men's health is a really important aspect and I feel like men are pretty bad at looking after themselves, myself included sometimes. And I think that Men's Health Month gives us the unique opportunity and kind of a reminder to pay attention to our priorities in life. And one of the main priorities is your health. When I look at health, specifically the health of men as they age, one of the pillars is prostate cancer awareness and prostate cancer screening. Prostate cancer is a very common disease. 12% uh, of men will be diagnosed with prostate cancer in their life. 3% of those men will actually die of the disease. So it's a very common and serious disease. Prostate cancer screening is something that since it's been out in the 90s, it has lowered prostate cancer specific death by 50%. So it's a very unique and good screening tool to prevent a very dangerous disease. The prostate MRI has really changed the game as it pertains to the diagnosis and management of prostate cancer cancer. Now that we have it here, there are countless stories I can tell you of how it's avoided biopsies in some men, but more importantly it's made me more accurate in my ability to diagnose prostate cancer. Probably one of the patients that sticks in my mind the most is PSA, that lab looking for prostate cancer was getting higher and higher, so we decided to get a prostate MRI. It showed an area of concern in a part of the prostate that you typically don't sample with standard biopsies, and we ultimately targeted that area and found a significant cancer of the prostate, which we later treated. Now he's three and a half years out and disease free. And I am pretty confident that his story would have been very different if we did not do that prostate MRI. And there's a lot of controversy around screening and when men should get screened, but I ascribe to the American Neurologic Association's guidelines. And what they recommend is for normal risk men, they should start their screening at age 50. If you're a man that has high risk features, meaning you're African American, or you have a family history of prostate cancer, you should start screening at age 40. After your initial screen, we can determine the interval at which you get re-screened, but those two ages tend to be very important for those men. I think just making sure that you treat health like a priority, and it's one of the most important aspects to a man's longevity their vitality. You're never too old to get a primary care physician in your life. There are a lot of other health issues um, over and beyond prostate cancer that need to be addressed earlier in life. So I would say most men need to get a primary care physician in their life and get general screening labs done.